here we have the Mortz 20 plus 10 hydraulic beaver tail, 20,000 pound gooseneck flatbed trailer. Uh, Mortz has been well known for their uh, gooseneck flatbeds for years, being heavy built, built to last, and they've expanded on that with this uh, hydraulic beaver tail trailer. Uh, if we get up closer here, you'll see uh, has their uh, heavy duty neck that uh, is uh, standard on all of their gooseneck flatbeds now. Um, du dual jacks here on the front, lockable uh, toolbox on the front for convenient storage of chains and binders, straps and ratchets, and a built in uh, spare tire bracket on the neck. Spare tire and wheel is optional. Um, flip out crank for the jacks there, spring loaded drop legs. If we go back here, you'll see the uh, side toolbox with the hydraulic pump, battery, the battery uh, charges off of the truck when it's connected with a uh, built-in charge wire and circuit breaker in the pump box there. Um, oil bath, 10,000 pound Dexter spring, slipper spring suspension axles. And here we see the uh, hydraulic dovetail in the down position for loading. 10 foot long hydraulic dovetail. And uh, one of the really neat features is the heavy duty hinge point here. Grease fittings all the way across on top, easy, easily greasable, which will probably be one of your biggest concerns with this trailer. Here's the latching system, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, run this up once the equipment's loaded. Hit the up button on the control here. The tail will raise up, and as you see the light bar drops down as the tail comes up. The light bar, really neat feature, is hinged and has two heavy duty ramp springs on it up underneath there. So as the tail goes down against the ground, the light bar goes up in the tail and when you raise it up, the light bar drops down. LED lights all the way around, two stop turns on each side. License plate uh, bolts and light there. So when you raise the tail up, you have to go up past center and then you can flip down the latch and locks into place, letting it let it back down, runs the stoppers against the cylinder caps, and locks it in the level position. So um, if you do ever want to dock load, this thing does raise up past center to whatever dock height you need if you need to uh, dock load a piece of equipment. Flip the lever around the other way, unlocks underneath you go all the way back down to the ground. So it goes up past center for dock loading and here you'll see the light bar go up in as the tail goes down to the ground. As it comes back up the springs push the light bar back down. They're spring loaded so it's not something that's going to rattle and jump up and down on you. So when you raise it up, raise it up past center, flip the uh, lock lever around, let it down, and it locks into place in the level position. Right there, ready for the road. Just give you a walk around here. Adjustable gooseneck coupler, heavy duty frame, and Mort's uh, gooseneck flatbeds have a reputation for being heavy duty, built to last, and uh, they've just built, a, built on that tradition with this hydraulic beaver tail trailer. 20 foot deck, 10 foot tail, 30 foot, 20,000 pound gross weight. 